So hello and welcome to all of you all over the world. It is of course a fixture that needs no introduction. It is without doubt the ultimate game the continent has to give us, the final of Euro 2020. This competition has been one of change, one of many firsts, a new qualifying format, venues across the continent, no single host country, but I'm sure the debates about the success or otherwise of it will start as soon as the whistle is gone. Perhaps those debates already have, but one thing has never changed, and that is the fact that football keeps bringing us back for the very same reasons. These championships have again served the game well as a showcase for the best that it has to offer, perhaps helped in no small part by those changes which we have been witnessing. So let us hope it gets a fitting final. This, of course, a venue that needs no introduction. The iconic arch, a symbol of Wembley Stadium, the home of football. Quite some performance, and now here comes the response. For the players on both sides, this is their date with destiny, a chance to ensure their place in football history. It is without doubt, Peter, the greatest show we have this summer, and the fact that this is like a celebratory edition too makes it that little bit more special, doesn't it? I've certainly enjoyed it, giving us a, a fair share of just about everything we've come to expect from a competition of this magnitude, and yes, let's hope that it gets the perfect send-off. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. As with a lot of finals, caution plays a big part in the opening stages, but an early goal can blow all that away, so I hope that we can um, create a, a, an attacking contest here, which, which obviously we want for this showpiece. Back into the middle. That intervention was very necessary. Forward it goes. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Let us put a stop to that. Shoots! Oh, that is rather wayward. Belgium know they can rely on the counter and they've just expressed a warning. De Bruyne. Herrera Carrasco, and here's Azar. Azar provides an outlet. Oh, that's nice. Cross deflected behind for a corner. De Bruyne with the short one. And he's cut it out. Berghaus gets away from his opponent. Berghaus, he's had a goal! Goal, the Netherlands! That could turn out to be a big, big goal. He reverts to shoot, and he duly delivered. Ah, Peter, that was just a, a defensive act of generosity that was always going to uh, have a painful ending. The Netherlands take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Well, certainly the big occasion and a very big opening goal to boost everyone's confidence here.
Now it's Hazard. Carrasco. Now it's Luka. Shot at goal! A great save, real class. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Lint drives it forward. He's got options out wide. Berghaus could try cutting inside. Tries one! In it goes! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight! Jim, your thoughts? simple game, the striker's job is to find the space as often as possible, and he did exactly that. So that's two now without reply. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. There's been quite a few crosses coming in from that left-hand side. Hazard really is providing a, a very good outlet there, and his contributions, I think, are going to be key. Well, the defence have two choices. Deal with the man or, or deal... Look, Kaku! Hoists it forward. And helps available out wide. Going through. De Bruyne. Well read, he sorted that out. Memphis Depay. A heavy challenge. <laughs> Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire commitment like that, because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing, but instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Carrasco. And it's Carrasco. Witzel. Lukaku. Defenders on the back foot. And it's played forward. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. And here's Azar. Played into space out wide. Azar. Berghaus already with two goals under his belt. Good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Berghaus. Looking for a decent ball in. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Has a pop! Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. Well, there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. Time in the final, Jim. How do you read it? Well, it's obvious who's likely to be more content going in at half time, but I sincerely hope that there's a, a fitting response from the opposition to really engage us on the big occasion. The Netherlands ahead 2 0, and they are looking good. So we're just settling back into this second half.
Witzel. Azar. Tielemans. And here's Lukaku. position was perfect, the invitation was there for him, and his response absolutely clinical. Well, to his credit, he managed to ghost into space to, to finish things off, but the failure to spot him was, was ghastly defence. This is threatening to become a really good game. Uh, scoring early in this half just takes the pressure off now and allows them a chance to be a bit more patient in trying to level things up. Witzel demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Uh, the worst choice he could pick. He needed to get his head up and, and see the outlet to his right. Timely intervention. Hazard goes looking. And now the breakaway. Witzel. De Bruyne is onto it and can take it up. Balls out on the left, now. Torgan Hazard. Now it's Lukaku. Carrasco. Nicely measured pass. Now it's Hazard. Hazard. <laughs> Referee has seen that as a dive. Correctly so, Peter, it's an element of the game we just can do without. Witzel. Barbel. And here's the pie. And it's got through. Memphis to pie. It's Memphis to pie! A real chance and a real let off. Yeah, they've got away with it, but that was a, a defensive letdown to see him march through like that. So here comes the substitution. Played out to the right. He's got options out wide. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Really good feet. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. To Rome. Courtois will lay claim to that. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. And it's Memphis to pie. That's a foul, no two ways about it. And he is going into that little black book. Of accuracy that's gone a long way up and away good idea just poorly executed Memphis to pie he's got away beautifully done 
foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. And no surprise, that's a booking. Players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. Memphis Depay stands over the ball. He'll be looking to dink one in. So he's plotting something before playing it in. Aldevera is there to heave it away. That is terrific skill. Time to deliver. Barbol. Out towards the flank. The Tongan hit the slide tackle there. Well, this lead is tight, but it does look as though it may see them through. Just a few moments from glory. Belgium need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. Out to the right, and helps available out wide. Gorgeous control there. Whipped in. Repelled by the keeper. Mertens has a shot! There it is! We thought it was over! It's all square once more! Belgium are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. All square again into the dying minutes. Memphis Depay. There's no flag. It's wrestled off the ball. Looks to clip it forward. Lint cuts it out. Barbel. Now oh, it's Memphis Depay. Oh, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. You can get that clear. Lovely bit of skill. He's making good use of his strength there. Just refuses to be out. He's gone for it! Oh, what about that? And that has raised the roof! That was easy. Almost too easy. Well, it's pretty damning on the part of that defence, Peter, that he was allowed so much time and space. But I think you have to give credit where it's due. And it was a brilliant setup and finish. The Netherlands. And time is up. The Netherlands are the conquerors of Europe. Winners of the final in a European Championship that is truly delivered. And this is an honour which is truly deserved. What a moment this is for all connected with the team. It's a day for pride, a day for glory. Another grand chapter to be added to their glittering history.